Hello my friends and welcome back to the Deep Tarot. This is a reading for Venus sign in Libra. If your Venus sign is in Libra, this is your love reading. You're going to get one oracle card, then we'll start the reading. Everything you need to know about the schedule of the channel is in the description box. So let's start. Children, your love life being is being affected by children keep in mind this is a gender reading so it may not resonate with all of you and energy could be vice versa i'm gonna tell you a short story and you decide who is who in this story so if you're new please subscribe and hit that notification button so each time i post something new you will be notified let's see this is your person personality. This is how they feel about you. This is how they see your personality, how they see your appearance. Is this person from the past or new? How, what's their intentions towards you? Wow. This is a very painful reading. What's what they want to do, what they will do. And when outcome. This person personality is the tower something happened in this person life i don't know if this is and even from this card it can be that this person can be a past person or a new person but both of you went through a very painful situation and that situation was a life change for both of you. Now, it could be that you and this person went together in this situation, or maybe each one of you went in the same kind of situations individually. It kind, it seems like this is, two stories or two background for one story. The story is the same. It applied if this person is a new person or a past person. As long as you, this is your energy and you are, you left or you were in a very painful relationship. Something happened between you and your person or this person put you in a very painful situation and from there things went south between you two. This person personality, see, I'm gonna try to make this story clear and give you everything I feel not in a confusing way because I feel so many things coming to my mind and I'm not sure which one I have to start to. This is a lot of conflict, a lot of pain, a lot of problem between you and someone or maybe, be yeah, between you or someone. Even if this someone is the same person here or another one. So I'm trying to organize my thoughts and feelings so when I start to talk, my words will make sense because I feel as much as the energy is coming hard and conflict, confused to me, I think I'm, I'm not gonna do a good job explaining how I feel. Let's start 
card by card so it will not be confusing to you or to me. This person went in a very bad experience in life. A tower moment. Destroyed everything they knew about life. All their belief system. Now this person right now is in the energy of they lost what they used to believe in or the life they used to live in. But till now, this person didn't start to build something new. They are still cleaning the dust of the past. Because of this, their feelings towards you is the seven of wands. This person is very defensive very defensive because they are lost they are not ready to do anything right now how they see your personality they see you as the ten of ones they see how hard life is for you and they see how much you hold on your back and they see how tired you are. They see you burdened, really burdened and tired and about to fall down. I think you are one step ahead of this person. This person is still under the shock of that tower. You passed that, but you are now burdened and you don't know what to do with all this heavy pain and maybe responsibilities that you have on your shoulders. This person is still conflicted. They don't know what's going on around them. They're lost. You are not. Because of that, I'm saying you are a, one step ahead of this person. I think you passed this part of the story or this part of the tower. How they see your appearance, you are giving the impression to everyone, including this person, that you are in the Ten of Wands. You are, your life is perfect. And I believe this children card belong to you maybe you have children you're raising by yourself and this is part of the burden not the children but the responsibilities that comes with a child or maybe if this is not about children you have responsibilities, a family member, a father, a mother, or maybe alone. Something you are responsible for, and this responsibility is very heavy on your shoulders. You are barely surviving, and sometimes you are not. But you are not showing that to anyone. This person, if they will look from outside, they will see you in the Ten of Pentacles. Everything in your life is under control. While I believe this, this person knows that for real, no, you are not. This person is feeling what you are feeling because they are almost in the same situation as you. So they can understand and feel what you are going through. Is this person from the past or new? It can be both. Maybe this is a new person and they lived a situation similar to yours. Or they have a tower moment and you had your tower moment. This person 
their intentions, they are in the nine of wands. This person, they know that they are not ready to do anything with you or to come closer to you. What they want, they want the four of wands. If this person is a past person, that the one that you have in mind, I am talking here on in this reading about someone you are thinking about right now. Even if this person is a new person, you know that person. This is not situation will happen. This is something going on in your life. If this is not something going in your life, it, maybe this is not your reading. This person, if they were a past person, they want you back in their life. And if this is a new person, they want you in a committed relationship right now. This is their wish, what they want. Because this person knows exactly how you feel. Because they feel the same. And they think that you can help them and they can help you. You can help each other go through this time. But this person, this is what they want. But this person doesn't believe that they are in a position where they can offer you this and they are absolutely right. They want, but they can't. They want to be with you. But they don't know what to do with this situation. Like they feel because they are lost. If they will come close to you, they will give you more burden in your life and your life will be more conflicted than now. Because this person right now is not ready to help anyone. Because they are lost. They don't know how to help themselves. So how can they help someone else? Because of this, what this person will do is stay inside this Eight of Swords energy. Not like tied to something, blind, not knowing what to do. This person is not ready at all to be in your life. Not because they are not interested. This person knows that they will make your life harder if they will come closer. And I think this is something this person doesn't want to do. They don't want to make your life harder than it is. But if you're asking in this reading, if this person interested in you, absolutely yes. They want you. They want everything with you. But what's stopping this person is this. They are in a tower, seven of wands, nine of wands. And they're sharing the five of wands energy with you. So this person is very defensive and they don't want to come closer because they know if they will come close to you, they will bring you nothing but trouble. This person knows that they are not in a posi position to offer you anything except more problems. 
And because of that, I don't think this person will do anything to come closer. What they will do, they are here in the Eight of Swords. They don't know what to do. They don't know how to come out of this energy. For now, for this reading, I don't think this person is ready to do anything. Maybe later on, when the dust settle and they know on one where they are standing, maybe things will change. But now, while the tower is still coming down, this person is not ready. Let's see the outcome. It seems that there is a cycle will end here. The question is, this cycle will end and everything here will, will end, including this person, or a cycle will end and a new cycle will start with this person. I think only time can answer this question because right now this person is not ready. I'm going to take a card to see if this person is in love with you. Do they have a feeling? How does this person feel? They want to manifest something. I believe this person will try to be with you, will try to manifest something with you and close this cycle of burden and tired and sad and conflicted but this will take time and i believe you will reach somewhere but not right now you will but it will take some time till both of you close the the past cycle and start to open something new this person is trying to manifest you in their life. And if the magician will come, I think by time they will succeed. And this is how I feel. I think this relationship has a chance, but it needs time. Well, thank you so much for being with me, my friends. I hope this reading was a helpful in a way. Wish you all the best. I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day. Bye.